Hey, what's going on there, YouTube? This is SDL 0320 representing JVS. I got here, Sean the Man Turn Time. We just came Me? out. <laughs> we just came out of looking at uh, Birth of a Nation. Um, these are our first impressions of the movie. What, what was your thoughts, man? My thoughts was it was amazing. I think that every race, like I said, yeah. uh, I said it before, but I feel like every race should partake in this movie and actually look at it yeah. and understand that um, the nation was lied to in many different ways, but you know, at the same time, uh, I feel like it restored, it, it could restore people's faith. That's, yeah. that's definitely what I get from it. Uh, I like that they in, they included God in it. Yeah. But, you know, yeah. Uh, that's just the simple basis of it. But yeah. uh, I enjoyed the movie. I, I would recommend it to anybody. Yeah, I, I'm the same way. Like, I really thought it was very powerful. Um, visually, it was powerful. Um, the message can go either way because it's, it's, it's subjective in the sense of, like, what happened. No matter what, nothing can deny that everything that they was actually showing in the movie actually happened. And how people adjusted to it was according to looking through Nat Turner's life, you know what I'm saying? And one of the things I'll say about the movie, it was a lot of biblical foundation that jarred him through his life up until a certain point. And it was like, the only thing I can really compare it to is like the Israelites. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, and going through like different parts of the Bible of slavery. Mm -hmm. And I think the end of the day for me, and this I'm going to say this in my review, is that evil is something that is addicting and it can spread really easily and I think it, it spread through the course of the whole entire movie and I mean it's not just the evil of slavery but it's the perspective that that's something that's okay and it's okay to condemn a people like that you know what I'm saying I, I think it is very powerful I really recommend everybody go check it out it's gonna be very jarring and it's gonna be very controversial but I think it needs to be so we can get to a common ground place as men and women got considering what's going on in the world right now yeah but uh I don't know. That's all I got. Well, I mean, I, I was definitely impressed with the acting. The oh, acting was man. definitely... The, it, I mean, some people would say, you know, uh, there would be a lot of tear jerking in it. But uh, for me personally, I, I know I cried. Yeah. Because, I mean, there yeah. was some parts in there that you just couldn't... I mean, like, I, I'm not going to go into any specifics, but I mean... The movie period will make you uh, feel some kind of way, not yeah. angry towards white people. Yeah. Uh, more so, it will give you knowledge about how you know. I guess uh, how they went through the progression of uh, slavery, and this, yeah. it, it kind of make you feel some kind of way only in the terms of uh, you feel bad for what our ancestors had to go through. Yeah. But yeah. at the same time, you know. Uh, to be equipped with that type of knowledge, we shouldn't go out and look for people to really uh, blame or point fingers at for things that's happened in the past. So uh, I feel like this could make us strong as not only black people, but as a nation. So yeah. uh, I think people should really, really keen in on the specifics of the movie and not just look at it as black people getting beat. Because uh, I feel like that's how I uh, looked at Roots. Mm -hmm. I looked at Roots saying, well, I ain't gonna let no white person do that to me, or you know, uh, it's definitely gonna be uh, uh, a different way I look at white people. But I look at all people really uh, equally, especially if you have respect. Yeah. So, uh, uh, like I said, I look at the movie more so as a growing tool, and we should be able to look at it without malice and uh, hate towards anybody. Yeah. We should be able to look at it and learn from it, and just be happy that. Uh, we are delivered from those times. Of course, yeah. we have some stuff going on nowadays that kind of um, take us back. And, you know, we, we look at it like, oh, we wish this didn't happen that way. But uh, I do believe that this movie will clarify a lot of things and a lot of uh, questions that people have. Yeah, and that's, that's what I you know, just touched back into, like, the clarification of evil is something that can be a cancer. And, like, that same exact evil is kind of present here. But it's different in just how it's actually identified. And so the, I think the objective of the movie is to try to make sure we identify what's going on so we don't make the same exact mistakes again. And, and even like he said with the acting, the acting was dope. Like, I thought that this was going to be an Oscar bait kind of movie. No, it's just like the performances, when the th scenes were actually happening, they were so believable that they just like, man, I can't believe this is happening. You know what I'm saying? So I highly recommend it. I'm going to do my review tonight. Hopefully, y'all enjoyed our reaction. We'll talk to y'all later. Peace.